Sagittarius, this is Inspire 2016 with your monthly reading for the month of July 2017, focusing on your career and work life. I hope that you have a good month so far for the month of June 2017. And as always, we, we already pre shuffled the card for you prior to the reading, so let's get started. So the first card for you representing the present position or the beginning of the month you have the four of club so this may be some kind of uh, family gatherings or work gathering that you may have to attend in the beginning of the month uh, and it looks like there are a lot of uh, cheerful and happy moments uh, in your life in the beginning of the month maybe if you have been planning for a holiday trip or vacations in some way and towards the middle, sorry, towards the beginning of the month, you may have uh, enjoyed those moments or those uh, plannings or those holiday trip that you may already plan planted before. So the next card that you have representing the influence card or the bridge card uh, towards the middle of the month, you have the eight of spade. So I don't see the negative feelings here with this card. Maybe you are maybe being uh, a little bit afraid of uh, everything is going well in your life. It may be some kind of traumatic uh, influence of your uh, bad experience in the past. It makes you holding you back in some way. It looks like there are some kind of suspicions here with this card. It looks like uh, there are a couple of things that may uh, happen in your career. Maybe it's like everything goes very well and you may be uh, wondering why everything is going in your favor or everything is going fairly uh, good in some way and there's something that you may have to appreciate and grateful about those things and it looks like if you have been thinking of you know like holding you back and not enjoying the moment it looks like like, like this card it looks like you don't have the capability to move forward so maybe you are doub uh, doubting about your own capabilities like your skill set or your competence here with this card it looks like like in the middle of the month or the middle of the month maybe there are somebody or some people that are challenging you with regards to your skill or with regards to your passions or with regards to your capabilities in your let's say solving the problems in the in the in the workplace so the next card that you have representing the past position, you have the Ace of uh, Spade. So this card in the case in the past, there are a lot of uh, news comes your way. It can be representing uh, related to this card. There are like a lot of uh, celebrations or invitations that comes your way towards the uh, end of June, for instance, or in the past. It may be some kind of uh, a lot of uh, possibly news that are showing you that you are in being invited to their uh, home or to their place it can also represent like if you have been looking for a new job that can also be the case like if you uh, finally in the past you receive a lot of uh, news like can be also email or it can be also posts 
or any sort of uh, text messages, call, whatever the information can be. And towards the beginning of the month, you are celebrating the cost of those. Uh, for instance, if you already uh, finally get the offer or get a job in some way, and you want to celebrate it with your friends or with your loved one as well. So the the next card that you have representing the things that you learned from the past, you have the Ace of Heart. So this card indicates that you may have some kind of uh, emotional fulfillments uh, in the past that you may wanting to experience again in the in the present or in the future. It looks like you are being content in the past that you are sufficient enough with whatever the case for instance you have enough money to buy food every day and you don't have to be like worrying about uh, the next day can you still buying those type of uh, basic need in some way it's something that you feeling like you are being content and happy and joyful with the little things that, uh, that are going well in your life and maybe something that you also doubting yourself with this card related to that card as well. So there, there is something going on here. It looks like you don't feel confident with your own capability or with your own sense of happiness as well. So the next card that you have representing the things that you need to let go from the past, you have the Eight of Diamond. So the Eight of Diamonds here representing the skill that you have already uh, gathered from the past that something that you may not need it anymore. So again, if you are holding back because of these, it looks like if you have been dealing with several, uh, let's say, people who judge you in the way you've conducted the, the whole uh, work, in some way maybe you don't have the baseline of the skill that you need and it's something that you may want to learn again but this card showing you that those skills has already planted inside and you have you have um, you have already uh, mastered those skill and that is something that you need to let go now that you you don't need to study or you don't need to to hound your skill again you don't need to to learn relearn again you don't have to do it because those skill has already inside and you already master those skill and it's just only yourself that that holding you back that makes you feel that you are not capable you have to re restudy again or you have to do uh, let's say you have to relearn the whole things again like the skill set that you may not be able to do so blah 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 and as all of those are excuse because you know inside of you that you know how to do it so this uh, the next card that you have representing the future card you have the six of club so yeah it looks like you finally uh, open yourself it looks like you don't be trapped inside of your own thought, your negative thought in this case. It looks like you are opening up and you want to make sure that everything is uh, in your favor because you know yet you can do the whole things. You know that the whole skills that you already have are sufficient to finish the whole projects. And that's the reason why you get this uh, six of clubs as a victory card for you towards the end of the month. So for those of you who have been getting a new job, then you may have a lot of uh, challenges in the middle of the month. And towards the end of the month, you finally uh, be able to to solve those problems and to be a victorious uh, winner in the end. So to confirm the whole reading, let's see what is the last card for you. To on the, at the bottom of the deck, as a confirmation card, you have the nine of heart so how beautiful this is it looks like you have the support that you need and also people are surrounding you who wanting to help you out but they just because of yourself that are holding you back and you don't feel confident enough it makes you feel bad about the whole situations but but the fact is that you have those skills and you know that you know that you know that 
you are capable enough for doing so and that's something that you have already confirmed here with the nine of heart it looks like you have uh, the wish fulfillment and you have everything you need and you finally get it in the end so i think that's overall uh, rating for you for the month of july and 2017 and if you like and rest on it with you the reading just click like and also if you haven't subscribed already just click subscribe and see you next time thank you